Hey YouTube, it's Lip Balm Queen here. Just wanting to get here today, and I wanted to do some first impressions of some brand new lip balms I recently had sent to me from an awesome friend named Andrea. She sent me a package a couple months ago just full of different lip balms, and I have not had time to sit down and review all of them yet because there were so many in that box. So today I'm going to do a few of some first impressions of a brand that she sent me that I've never tried before. And this is the brand called My Lip Stuff. If you've ever heard of this brand and you've tried them before, comment down below. Let me know what you think of them. So the one she sent me, I'm going to go through really quick and then we'll try them out. The first one she sent me is Banana Nut Bread. So I'm excited for that one. And then she sent me one called Blue Moon Ice Cream. And then this one I'm so excited for. This one's called Circus Peanut. And she told me that's one of her favorites, so I know that I'm going to love that. Because me and her, we are so much alike on lip balms and stuff of what we like and what we don't like. Um, then she sent me one called Orange Chocolates. Then she sent me one in Funnel Cake. And she sent me one in Honey Butter. So I'm really excited for these. So let's go ahead. I'm going to wipe off my lip color so I can go ahead and do the first impressions. And uh, we will see what I think of them. Okay, dry my lips off a little bit. So the first one we're going to do is Banana Nut Bread because I just feel like this is going to be a good one. So we'll go ahead and try this one out. So it is a clear balm. Oh man, and it really does smell like Banana Nut Bread. Oh man, you can smell like the... It really does smell like Banana Nut Bread. You can smell like the nuttiness of it and you can smell the banana in it. Oh my gosh, that's amazing. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and try it out. I love the nice shine it gives. This just rolls on like butter, like it's so smooth. It has like an oily texture to it, but it's one of the moisturizing ones where it just feels really like slick on your lips. It feels good. Um, wow. If you lick your lips though, I don't really get much of a flavor. But you definitely smell it. It smells amazing. This really is spot on banana nut bread, so super excited for that. Do like that one. This is definitely one I'm going to be using a lot because I just I already know. I can just tell. It says, the finest natural butters and oils and blended to create the ultimate lip moisturizer for kissably soft lips. And uh, they are manufactured in Delaware. And their website is mylipstuff.com, which I will uh, put that in the description box down below for you guys so you can check out their site. Um, but, oh my gosh, I'd never even heard of this brand before until she sent me these. So I was so excited for that. Okay, so the next one we have is Funnel Cake, which sounds exciting because who doesn't love a funnel cake? Make me think of a fair or something. Alright, so this one's a clear balm as well. And this one just has like a sweet, sweet scent right now. So let's swatch it. Yeah, this one just has like a really sweet scent, so let's go ahead and try it out. So this one I wouldn't say right off reminds me of a funnel cake. Like it has a sweet scent to it, like a funnel cake has. But to me, it kind of smells like marshmallows. Like it has like a sweet, um, sweet scent like that. Mmm. I still like it, but I'm just saying, like, in my mind, if I was just to smell this right off and not have, like, an idea of what the flavor was, I couldn't tell you it was funnel cake. I just feel like it would be, like, a marshmallowy smell. So, it still smells fantastic, though, and super sweet, and I really do like it, so I'm excited for that. And if you lick your lips, you don't really get much of a flavor. You just get that scent of the, uh, like, marshmallowy, like, sweet scent. It smells really nice, though. So, we're going to go to the next one. onto orange chocolates. It's a clear bomb. Oh, wow. That smells so good. It definitely has an orange and chocolate scent to it. Oh, wow. I think I'm really going to love this. 
you know those big heart candies you get at Valentine's Day? They're full of the different chocolates and stuff, and you have like the different flavored ones. There's always one that I get, because I get like this variety one every year, and it always has an orange and chocolate one, and this is exactly what that smells like. Oh my goodness, let's try it out. And if you lick your lips, you don't get a sweetness, you just get like a little hint of like an orange flavor. But my gosh, that's good. It's like a perfect mix. You get the mix of the chocolate, the mix of the orange, and together they just feel, they smell fantastic and they feel so good on the lips, this lip balm does. Mmm. Yes, definitely recommend that one. If you love anything orange chocolate, you will love that. That smells so good. Makes you think of Valentine's Day. Um, so then the next one we have is Circus Peanut. So I'm so excited for this because when I was little, I liked the Circus Peanut candies. The ones that are like the little like, they're not foamy, but they're like a weird nougat um, feel of a candy. And um, I know you know what I'm talking about, like the little orange candies that look like peanuts. Um, they always had a really sweet, like interesting scent. Um, it's one of the things, if I did eat some, I couldn't eat a lot because I felt like they were so sweet that they would make me sick after a while, but, um, I love that scent. So, this one's a clear bomb. Oh my gosh, they have captured that scent. Oh my god, that's crazy. Yes. Oh my gosh, it's like I just opened up a bag of circus peanuts. Oh my goodness. How did they get that scent? That smells identical to just opening up a bag of those candies. I gotta try this one on. So you don't get the flavor, which like I've said, you don't really get much of the flavor of them, but the scent is there and it smells spot on to a circus peanut candy. Oh my goodness, they nailed that scent, so very excited for that one. I knew I'd be excited for it because I just felt like it was going to be a good one. And plus, Andrew had told me it was good, but I had to know for myself because I have to try it. That one was awesome. So now we have Blue Moon Ice Cream, and I have no idea what Blue Moon Ice Cream is. I know what ice cream is, but what's Blue Moon, you know? So we're going to see. So it is a clear bomb. Mmm, that's an interesting scent. Wow, I don't really know what that's supposed to be. That has such an interesting scent. Like, it smells like it has a little bit of vanilla in it. And maybe a little bit of coconut, maybe a hint of it. But there's something else, and I can't figure out what that scent is. But it smells so good, so I'm going to try it. This one's nice. I really like it. I don't know what the scent's supposed to be, but it smells good, and if you lick your lips, you kind of get that flavor, like that sweet, um, whatever that scent is, you get that flavor too, and I don't know what that flavor is. It's like it has a little bit of a coconut, a little bit of vanilla, but there's something else, and I can't figure out what it is. But I really like it, so <laughs> maybe one day I'll figure out what it is, that, that extra ingredient that I can't figure out. But it smells so good. Mm, I love that. That's very interesting. I like that lip balm. And the last one we're going to do is Honey Butter. So let me wipe my lips off. And I love how moisturizing these are. Like that, It has like an oily consistency at first, but as it's on your lips, it like starts absorbing and it's just amazing on the lips. It feels so good. So we have a clear balm again. I'm going to have to swatch this one because I can't smell much of it. Okay, now I'm getting the honey scent. It's not super strong, but it's there. Um, so let's try it on. Oh, this one's nice. It's not super strong. Um, but you definitely get that, that honey scent, and I don't get any flavor when I lick my lips, but 
it's really nice. It's not super strong. It's not that overpowering strong honey scent that you can get in some lip balms because I've had plenty that's been that way overpowering and makes me not want to use it because I like honey flavored things and I like honey. But um, sometimes if it's supposed to be flavored honey and it's not like an authentic honey, it's a weird artificial honey, it's like makes you not want to use it for me like personally because I just don't like the, an artificial honey flavor. But this one actually smells like a fresh honey and it's like it's a light scent though. But it's super nice. So I'm really impressed with this brand. Um, I'm really surprised I'd never heard of this brand before. Because, I mean, I'm always on the hunt for a new lip balm, right? So I'm actually quite impressed with this. And I got to say, if you're looking for a lip balm that's not flavored but has an amazing spot on scent, definitely check out my lip stuff. Um, I will leave their website down below for you guys so you can check them out. And I want to thank my friend Andrea for sending me these so I could try them out and review them for you guys and give you my first impressions. So super excited for these. And like I said, my favorite has to be the orange chocolates and the circus peanut because they are spot on, guys. So I hope you guys enjoyed this review. And if you did, please hit the like button, subscribe if you haven't already, and comment down below if you've tried this brand before and which ones you have. So maybe if there's one that I haven't tried, maybe I'll um, be interested in purchasing it and finding it. And maybe I'll do some first impressions on those. So comment down below if you have tried the My Lip Stuff brand. And let me know which ones you've tried. And also hit the notification bell so you're notified every time I upload. So I hope you guys have a blessed day and I'll see you in my next video. Thanks. Bye.